Hello, and welcome to this quick start video on the Benro X-Series 3XS Phone Stabilizer. In this short video, we'll walk you through the Benro mobile application, calibrating your gimbal, and using the advanced features to help you create dynamic imagery using your 3XS smartphone stabilizer. If this is your first time using the app, you should perform an initial calibration on your gimbal. Let's get started. First, make sure your phone is balanced. For detailed instructions on how to balance your phone on the 3XS gimbal, please refer to our balancing video. Download the Benro Gimbal app to your mobile device. Power on your 3XS gimbal and make sure your phone has Bluetooth enabled. Launch the Benro app. The first screen you will see is the stabilizer selection screen. Select X series and then press select device. Now choose the 3XS if the app does not automatically choose it for you. Once the 3XS is selected, press enter device. Once you enter the device, you will be prompted to pair with nearby devices that are powered on. Select your device. Once your device is selected, you will be prompted to upgrade the firmware if necessary. If you don't see this screen right away, you can find it by navigating to the settings menu. Within the camera tab, you can change settings such as resolution, codec, bitrate, add grid lines, and adjust zoom and focus settings. Now, let's navigate to the Gimbal tab in the same menu. Here, you will find the preset shooting scenarios. Run, which allows less sensitivity and faster response. Walk, provides more sensitivity and slower response. Custom, allows you to make your own preset. If you drop down the Customize button submenu, you can customize two buttons on the gimbal to four different functions, each dependent on how long you press the button. Follow Mode Toggle switches the shooting mode on your 3XS between Pan Follow and Omnidirectional Follow. Orientation Switch will rotate your phone's orientation between horizontal and vertical shooting modes. Wireless Charge enables wireless charging on compatible devices. Turn 180 degrees will rotate your phone 180 degrees, which allows you to capture whip pans, higher quality selfies, and more. Switch camera will switch the enabled camera between front facing and rear facing. Parameters will pop up the parameter setting menu. And scenarios will pop up the scenario menu for quick switching. Now let's calibrate the drift by pressing drift calibration. For best results, drift calibration can be achieved by turning off your gimbal, removing your smartphone, locking the motors, and folding up the gimbal. Once you've done this, turn your gimbal back on and make sure it's connected to your smartphone. Press drift calibration and start. Your 3XS will now go through a short calibration process. Your app will notify you when successfully completed. You may now rebalance and restart your 3XS. Let's proceed with the level calibration. This process will go through all facets of your 3XS's rotation. For level calibration, your 3XS needs to be in a standing position on a flat surface. Press level calibration and start. The 3XS will automatically calibrate and disengage the motors when completed. If you are unsuccessful, double check your balance, or if there is an obstruction, and try again. Once completed, you will get a notification if it was successful. To restart the gimbal, press the restart button. One amazing feature of the Benro 3XS is the ability for it to track faces and objects. You can enable this by tapping the photo video button on the right side of the screen. This will bring up the multiple modes available to shoot in. On the left side, scroll and select face track, then tap to the side of the menu to exit. If the feature does not automatically detect a face, simply draw a box with your finger around the face you want to track. Press record and the face tracking will begin automatically, adjusting the gimbal to focus on the face you are tracking. Object tracking works the same way. The motion time-lapse feature allows you to create a time-lapse with dynamic motion. With the motion path feature, you can create custom motions for your time-lapse. On the left side of the Modes menu, scroll until you find the Motion Time-Lapse button. Tap outside the box to prepare your time-lapse. 
You select points by using the joystick to turn the phone to your start, middle, and end, and then clicking the rear trigger to choose each point. Once these are selected, tap next. Now choose the time interval between shot, the number of photos you'd like to take, and exposure values if you choose to adjust it. Once these are selected, press the record button on the handle to begin the time lapse. The time lapse will automatically save to your phone. The panorama feature allows you to fit more of the amazing view into your photos and take stunning panoramas. On the right side, scroll until you find panorama. Once selected, tap to the side of the menu to close and return to the view screen. Press the record button on the handle to start the panorama. Try your best to keep the gimbal still. Now you know all you need to know about the Benro Gimbal mobile app. Get out there and shoot something spectacular.